No, he's not fit. He's not fit to play football, unfortunately. Um, he played in a reserve game the other day and I could have run about more than he did. So, uh, no, I can't pick him. I'll pick people that want to try and deserve to be at a good football club like QPR and want to work and come in every day and want to work and train and show a good attitude. And that's what I got today from the players. When he starts doing that, whether he ever can do it, maybe he'll get a game. No, it's the same old people. Same old people. You've we've got two or three of them, but 99. But the other lads, I've got a fantastic group of lads here. Absolutely superb, all of them. I just got asked. I just got an asked, asked an answer. I can't keep protecting people. We don't want to run about and train and about free stone overweight. What am I supposed to keep saying? Keep get, keep getting your 60, 70 grand a week and don't train. What do, you know? What's the, what's the game coming to? No, there's no. The others are all good as gold. Good as gold. Well, no, I was over exaggerating. There's not two. I can't think of another two. No, the other lads are good as good as gold. Fantastic, all of them. I don't go home and worry about speculation, George. You know what I mean? I'm 68 nearly. What am I supposed? You know what? What am I worried about? I'm not 35 with five kids trying to pay a mortgage. If you know, I do my best. I do my best every day. I come in early every morning. I'm in the training ground early. I leave late at night. I love my job. And I do my best. Can't do any more. There ain't no one could do any better here at the moment than me. I don't think. Oh, yeah, other names mentioned. I don't think. <coughs> they couldn't do any better than what I can do. That's for sure.